What's up, Fusion fans, and welcome back to another Idol Talk video. And in today's video, we're going to talk about Idol merch. So just like any other pop group, you know, uh, Idol groups in Japan also sell their merchandise. And, well, it's basically no different from, like, uh, K-pop groups, for example. Like, K-pop groups also sell their merchandise. And, of course, J-pop idols as well. So, well, I am no stranger to collecting uh, stuff myself. So, if you have seen probably uh, the Facebook post that I have uh, made uh, earlier, just before recording this video, I will be sharing my own collection as well. Now, this isn't going to be an exhaustive uh, collection presentation. Like, this is not everything that I have. Like, I do have a lot of stuff here, but I'm just going to show you guys the most important, in my opinion. And first off, I'm going to start with the shirt that I am wearing right now. So I am going to stand up a bit and show you guys this shirt right here. So as you can see, this is a shirt of Minami Minegishi from AKB48. And this shirt, I actually had it made in around 2015. So I actually went to Nagoya to order this shirt. I went to the store and uh, actually have it personalized, kind of. So uh, I will show you guys the back. I hope you can see it, guys. So as you can see, hopefully, so it says Nichan Kami Oshi. <laughs> so uh, this was part for the AKB 48 for 41st single uh, general election. So uh, like each member had their posters made. So yeah, kind of like an actual election poster. So this is what it look. This is what her poster looked like, and you can get it in shirt form. Uh, you could also buy the posters as well, but I just wanted the shirt. So uh, if you guys look closely here, so I'm going to stand up again. So there is actually a sign right there. So that is uh, SKE48 uh, Cafe and Shop. Now, I have mentioned this before in my earlier idol videos, uh, and I've actually shown that place to you guys in... You know, in uh, around the same time, uh, actually, almost yeah, two years ago. So, uh, if you guys haven't seen it, uh, probably posting it uh, in the description. I went to that shop. That's where I ordered this shirt personally. So this is the first uh, in my collection that I'm going to show you guys. So this isn't actually uh, the only shirt that I have. I also have another uh, Minami shirt, which is from her birthday. Uh, I think it was 2016, uh, around that time, I guess. But uh, this is my best uh, shirt that uh, I've ever gotten so far from the group. So this one I actually wore. Uh, I I've actually worn in 2017 when I went to Nagoya for... A handshake event and of course to meet Minami herself now the thing is it was actually quite embarrassing to wear this one because she was uh, in the lane with the two other members and you know yeah showing support for uh, one member is fine but uh, I just hope it wasn't really rude to the other two and uh, again uh, just but really I wanted to show her lo my loyalty so uh, that's just uh, one uh, just one way to show uh, who your favorite members are so of course uh, you would be seeing uh, shirts from other members and during those kinds of events so uh, of course now it's impossible almost to have that kind of event normally but back then people a lot of people not everyone but a lot of people would wear shirts uh, with their favorite members on it so either a birthday shirt uh, yeah because uh, members actually sell shirts uh, for their birthday so uh, 
I also you also have these. So yeah, any any shirt related to either the group or a specific member, uh, it would be very common during those kinds of events. So next off, so this is actually a collection that I have uh, started way back, even when I started. So these are some photo cards. So actually, uh, some of these. So this one, uh, I believe. Uh, some of these I actually got from Dan himself. Yes, I think the first two photos that I have actually bought came from Dan. So I, I think this one as well. Uh, which one? Ah, also this one, I think. So a lot of uh, Minami Minagishi photos in here. So this album it, uh, is also an AKB48 photo album, specifically designed to hold these uh, photo cards, of course. And uh, that event that I mentioned earlier uh, in 2017, that's where I also got this photo album right here. So uh, again, uh, I do have a lot of Minami cards, so uh, I think I also have here uh, some other photos of other members, uh, so uh, some of these I got from another friend. So these kinds of photos you either get from uh, like, uh, like buying uh, the albums or uh, so just like <laughs> so this exact same uh photo is on this shirt right here so yeah uh what else oh so these cards for example so these photos uh, uh akb48 used to have a net shop but uh it recently closed down uh, but back then, uh, that's where you get a lot of these uh, monthly photo cards. So uh, usually, uh, they are sold in either a five-piece set. So like one, two, and uh, three, four, five. So these ones. So I do have another set right here. So one, two, three, four. Four or five. I hope you guys can see that because the sun is reflecting so hard. But yeah, I used to order a lot of these. Uh, so again, they release every they release every month. So there is uh, usually a theme as well. So because this was an October set, I believe. No, uh, they released it in September. But I guess they released it in advance for Halloween. So yeah. Uh, this is my photo collection. I do have photos of other members, but I kept it in a separate uh, special folder or a separate album. But this one is intended for the only, <laughs> for the one, the only Minami. <laughs> and the next one that I am going to share with you guys would be a couple of the uh, badges that I have right here. So, just in time for Christmas, actually. Uh, this... So these ones I actually got from a friend, so I bought these off of him. So yeah. I actually wore these as well with this shirt back in 2017. Oh, and speaking of events, I also recently wore this one uh, in October. Just, yeah, just a few months ago. So I actually uh, tried to attend an online event and of course I talked to Minami as well. So, next is definitely one of the rarer treasures that I would consider. So, this is uh, Minami, Min, uh, Minami Minigishi's photo book entitled South. So, this one I think was released back in... Uh, what year was this? Uh, I think this was released back in 2012 or... No, maybe earlier, but uh, so this is her first photo book. Mm. 
definitely kept it for quite a long time. 2008, imagine that. So, uh, this is the last page of the book. So, if you see here, yeah, that's 2008 right there. So, imagine. So, this is 12 years old. This book would have been 12 years old already. But, uh... I actually managed to get this uh, when I came six years ago. So uh, when I saw it in Nagoya, so the same uh, place as uh, this one uh, where I got this. So when I saw this book, I immediately uh, bought it right away because it was rare and definitely uh, right now, uh, you probably wouldn't find it anymore, so it would have been uh, out of print already. So definitely lucky to have got this one uh, as a physical copy. I think Dan gave me a uh, download link to the scanned edition. So like, uh, I downloaded it uh, thanks to Dan before, but... Uh, when I found the physical copy, of course, I definitely went on and got got it when I had the chance. So another uh, book that I have here is this one. So this is her second photo book. And this was released in 2015. So this would have this would be five years old already. So uh, this is smaller, definitely, but uh, there's a lot more stuff in there. Because this isn't only a photo book, but uh, some, in a way, some sort of a autobiography as well. That's why it's thicker, it's got a lot more text, so uh, stories about her life, uh, her career, and uh, everything that happened in between. So uh, this one. And uh, last but not the least, so this, like, uh, I have had this one displayed in my room for quite a long time. So this is a, t I hope you guys can see it. There we go. Uh, uh, no, this is not the last, but definitely uh, one of my uh, more prized collections. So this tapestry I also got in 2015, I think. The sun, just to uh, hope you guys see this. No? <laughs> the sun. Anyway, so uh, now this one I also ordered online, but AKB48 had another uh, online shop, but that was in connection with their actual restaurant and, and like cafe and shop in Tokyo. So the net shop and the cafe and shop online store are actually different. I know, it's confusing. So, uh, you can get this kind of uh, this kind of stuff in the store. You can also get some shirts, I believe, but uh, things like the photo cards or the photo sets, uh, they don't sell it uh, online or they don't sell it on the cafe and shop, I think. Uh, at least on the online version, but definitely... In the actual net shop, so you can get. Uh, well, you could have, you could get these back then, of course. So, but uh, this one is part of my collection, uh, which is which isn't really related to uh, any particular member. But uh, I do have this light stick right here, and obviously you can see. AKB48 written all over it, so I'm just covering it against uh, the light so you guys can actually see it's turned on. So this one has actually seven colors, so uh, when you turn it on, so it is pink. So this is white, red, blue, yellow, lighter blue, and then green. So you can actually switch to any color if you like. And this light stick I have been using... Uh, also since uh, 2015, and ever since I got this, I took this with me to any mini concert that uh, the group has. Actually, not only for AKB48, but other 
groups as well. Of course, uh, any group related to the 4D group, but yeah, I use these in a lot of events because, well, it's AKB48 and I consider AKB48 to be an umbrella group, not just the actual group in Tokyo, of course, but uh, actually, uh, this one uh, is very nice because the uh, although uh, there's been signs of aging right here, uh because of moisture so that coating kind of faded but uh let's just turn this off so ever since i got this the battery that i put in here is still the battery that i put five years ago so it's really efficient and uh, really saves up on uh, the battery usage. Again, it's the same battery that I put the very first day I tried this and never failed me since. So, uh, well, this is, a, this is the only light stick that I have right now. But yeah, uh, definitely. So again, uh, this isn't really my uh, complete collection, but definitely uh, for me, my most... Uh, prize possessions <laughs> in terms of uh idol merch but yeah uh so definitely uh i am a loyal fan so anyways uh, that's going to be it for this video so i hope you guys enjoyed so please do leave a like comment share this video subscribe and don't forget that notification bell so you get the latest from JD fusion this has been philip and i'll see you on the next idol talk bye